The doctor just told me Richard will make a full recovery. Oh, I am so relieved. Oh, and I was right there. When Richard started to wake up, first thing he did was ask for you. Did he say where he had been? We don't know what he's been through, so perhaps that question can wait. And what about the wedding? Did he have any misgivings? Misgivings? Catherine. That was the farthest thing from his mind. He couldn't wait to be married to you. You don't think he'd just walk away, do you? No. Then what's going on here? I don't know. There's got to be another explanation. Well, thank you, darling. Martha, what do you think of Rick's PI venture? Well, it's always been a big fantasy of his to be a private investigator, and he says that things are picking up. He's getting more calls at the office every day. Yeah, from fans wanting to meet him, or people with crazy theories about where he disappeared to for two months, or cases that aren't even worth looking into, like missing cats. Oh, well, that does seem a bit beneath him. You know, he did this because he was hoping that we would be able to work together again, and he thought he might have some interesting cases to solve, but right now it doesn't seem like he's getting much of either. Well, and if I know my son, then uh, <laughs> he may be sticking with it because he's too proud to walk away. Oh, darling, don't you worry about him. Do not worry about that trophy, because the only thing that anybody is going to remember from the final performance is that you sound like an angel. Except Martha. I won't. Well, of course you will. You just did. No, Martha, that's because it was just you and Rick. We weren't in public in front of strangers. Oh, no. Stage fright. It, it's, it's more like song fright. I mean, my heart just starts palpitating, and I start sweating, and my throat just chokes I know, up. I know, I know. It's classic, and it's awful. And why in the world would Richard sign you up for this? He doesn't know. Oh, honey, you have to tell him. Oh, I, do, I don't want to let him down. He wants this so badly. I want to give it to him, but I just, I don't know that I can. Oh. Richard is completely obsessed, and I am concerned about him. I know, me too. He never spoke to me about the missing time. I thought he was at peace with it, didn't you? Well, I guess the dreams made him realize that he wasn't at peace. He chose to forget those two months. He must have had a very good reason for wanting to do that. I think looking into this is a bad idea. Martha, I, I don't think that this is a choice for him. I think that he needs to know the truth. What if he never finds out the truth? What if he never learns anything? Or worse, what if he finds out something awful? I'll be with him wherever this leads, and I promise you, I'm not gonna let him go too far. Thank you.